Space Quest Stop button Alt plus S. Hi guys, this is Jake Gross. In this recording, I'm basically going to talk about and demonstrate the new Windows CE Themes installer. Basically, I realized that it was quite limiting having it was like only putting the sounds in C colon backslash CE sounds that was really limiting, and you didn't really get a user interface with the installer. So basically, I started messing with Inno setup. So I kind of made an installer using Inno setup, and I actually used an older version to compile it because I wanted it to be backwards compatible with Windows 9X. So I've uninstalled the sounds. I'm going to reinstall them. Run dialog type C colon text U. Item C sounds dot yet. File description. Windows C sound schemes setup. File version. 0.0.0.0 date created. 12 slash 21 slash 2069 41 pm size. 839k. Yeah, so that's the setup or percenter. Set, set up Windows C sound schemes dialog. Welcome to the Windows C sound schemes setup wizard. This will install Windows C sound schemes 1.0 on your computer. It is recommended that you close all other applications before continuing. Click next to continue or cancel to exit setup. Next button alt plus N. So we'll press next. To continue, click next. If you would like to select a different folder, click browse edit. Selected C colon backslash Windows backslash media backslash Windows C sound schemes. We'll just press enter. Install button out plus I. Cancel click in back button. Click install to continue with the installation or click back if you want to review or change any settings and it's multi-line read only. Destination location. Install button out plus and I. Install it. Next. Cancel button. 40%, 51%, 61%, 71%, 82%, 92%. Finish button out plus F. Set up Windows C sound schemes dialog completing the Windows C sound schemes set up wizard completing the Windows C sound schemes set up wizard set up has finished installing Windows C sound schemes on your computer click finish to exit set up finish button out plus F C code so install it now it appears in the control panel so you can simply uninstall it so virtual recorder dialog stop button out plus S yes, that's basically the new installer so I'll see you guys in the next recording bye